Hello everyone, in this video, we will talk about how you can boost and increase your FPS and the overall performance of Valorant on your PC. By having the maximum FPS that you can have in Valorant, you are making sure you are not missing the benefits that come with it. It's crucial to have an optimized PC to enjoy super smooth and responsive gamma play with the highest frames per second. That's what I am going to show you in this video. Rest assured that, if you follow all the steps of this video, in the end, you will feel the gamma play in Valorant like you've never done before. But before that, I ask you to subscribe to the channel and like this video. It inspires me to make new videos. Optimize startup apps and processes. You may have many apps running in the background that you don't use, consuming valuable resources such as RAM and CPU. This can cause you to have fewer resources to run Valorant and decrease the overall performance and FPS. Let's stop every app you don't use from running in the background. Next, navigate to Startup Apps you'll find a list of your apps that automatically start when your computer boots up. You'll want to get rid of most, if not all, to free up more resources for Valorant. Enable hardware-accelerated GPU scheduling. If you are streaming Valorant on OBS or Streamlabs, then don't enable this setting, because it can cause lags and micro-stutters in your stream and recording. You will lose a few FPS while playing Valorant, but everything will be smooth and stable. On the other hand, if you are not streaming, turn it on, because it will give you extra performance and frames per second in Valorant. Optimize Windows. In the descriptions below this video I will leave a link to this file. Download and unzip to the robot desktop. This file contains everything we need to fully optimize and increase FPS in Valorant. But before we start optimizing, I ask you to create a restore point. If you want to return the changed settings to the default, then this can be done through the restore point. Navigate to the second folder, which contains settings that will disable unnecessary Windows features. These functions spoil the system and prevent you from playing. You just need to apply all these commands. In the third folder, you need to disable Windows Update. I also left a file there that will turn Windows Update back on. The fourth folder contains the MSI mod program. Run this program as an administrator. After that, tick the MSI box on your video card and give it a high priority. After that, don't forget to apply the settings. In the next folder there is a circuit that is configured for maximum performance in games. To apply it, first you need to get this file and apply it. After that, the import directory will appear in the context menu, you need to click on it. Next, cleaning the system. This program will remove all unnecessary temporary devices that have been connected. To do this, you must click on select all and delete the selected. I have already recently cleaned up the system, so everything is clean here.
Copy my settings. Here you should uncheck the box. Video graphics settings. Copy my settings. All these settings will give the maximum increase in frames per second in Valorant. Hopefully, your problems with frame rate are over, and you'll now enjoy playing Valorant much more. Well, that's all for me, I hope I helped you. If yes, then I ask you to subscribe to the channel, and like this video. This inspires me to create new videos for you. See you soon, friends.